Councilmember Carla. Thank you, Mayor, and thank you, Mr. Mosby, for that. But as I recall this all going down, um, when Councilmember Forte was made aware of the possible violation that she had committed, she made us aware the very next day by email and apologized to all of us for unknowingly violating this code. And I believe that your response to the email was, isn't this private business? Why would it be appropriate to share with all of us? We didn't ask for this information. Contrary to beliefs, there are many council members that do not want to police other council members. True. So I'm not sure where True. at that point until this True. point you've had a change of heart. I still think that our job is to police our members, yes. That it has always been our job. But our job is also to read our charter and know that this council member did not willfully conceal this. She admitted it to us as soon as she found out about it. She self-reported it to the MEC. She came to the dais the very next week and apologized to the public for this issue. I don't think that gets us to willfully concealing or willfully violating anything. And a year ago, you had the same thought. So I'm not sure where it came from now and then, but obviously it's changed. Once again, I think that we know what we're voting on here. Our charter says she has to willfully conceal or willfully violate. Both those things have not been found. So I believe we need to vote on this and move on to our next agenda item. Thank you. Council Member Faith. Thank you, Mayor. 